Let's do it. Hey, what's up, JD Aliens? And a special what's up to all my bag whores out there because I got another one for you. This one's nice, man. This is another one of those gentlemen's bags. Hey, man, if you're gonna call yourself any type of respectable man, you got to have yourself a nice messenger bag. I'm not saying you gotta carry it around every day, but there comes a point in time in your life where maybe you go into a job interview or something kind of business casual. You wanna have yourself a nice messenger bag to have by yourself, not only cause it just looks so freaking fly and gentleman-like, but yeah, you just want to keep it professional sometimes instead of just having all your documents and stuff in your hand. But this one right here is made by Wowbox. It does house a, a 15 inch laptop, which I have in here already. And let me just show you some things that I really do like about it. This one, ooh, man, look at this one. It's got this raw hide leather. Y'all know I like that raw hide kind of stuff. Come on in here, man. Come a little closer so you can see this. So right here, you got this raw hide kind of stuff right here. And it's a gentleman's bag, so you gotta take your time with it because it's a little bit more sophisticated. It doesn't have these like quick snaps and buckles. It actually has real buckles, man. This takes you back to the old Western days right here where they had the satchels. This is, <laughs> this is like a satchel, boss. All right, so we undo these satchels right here. Once again, these are not like quick, you know, detached, you know, snaps or anything like that. Have some patience, man, and have some class. But underneath them, we do have these little magnetic buttons right here that'll kind of, once you line them up, they kind of close themselves. That way, if you don't, you know, buckle it down all the way, it still stays closed right there. But I want to pay special attention to this flap right here. This is unique. I know there are other bags out there like this, but this is one of those items, man. It's real leather, or at least it feels like it, man. It really feels fantastic. Let me see what it smells like. Got to. It smells like new stuff and leather. But yeah, man, this is one of those bags that the more you beat the crap out of it, the better it's going to look. It gets the oils from your hands and just, you know, that wear and tear is gonna make this thing look really, really nice. Look at the scratches. Every time you scratch it, it starts to look better. And it has that on the, um, on the sides right here as well. Look how weathered that looks, man. It comes like that. That is gorgeous. That weathered leather on each side of that. And that's all the leather you're gonna have. Well, you got you got some accents right here as well. But uh, man, this, this leather accents is just killing me right now. The handle, everything is just beautifully done with this. The stitching, it's, it's buttoned on there real nice. It's not coming apart. Everything about this bag says quality at a super budget price, man. But let's undo this flap right here so we can get up in it. There's your uh, your wow box branding right there. It's very classy in the way they've done it. It's just got like this little leather tab right there with the embossment right there. Get in there so you can see it. It says wow box. Yep. And then let's pull it back out. But I want to show you these gigantic pockets, man. These things are huge. Okay, so this is like the size of my hand right here. And then I've got my nomadic planner in here. This is a full size notebook in this pocket. It doesn't have any organization in either pocket, but I just want to show you how big this thing is. It is super large. So I don't know what you're going to put in yours. Mine just happened to fit right here. Let's go ahead and move in toward the inside. That way you can get a better look at what you're going to be getting into. Let's back all the way out. There we go. Okay. So we have this zipper right here. It's not a YKK. I don't believe it doesn't say it anywhere, but it seems to be a very durable and smooth zipper. We have this extra material right here. It's kind of like a pull tab. That way you can just kind of pull on this and just zip it just like that. You see how smooth that is? You hear that? Nice and smooth. It's not sticking at all. And it looks real nice as it just lays there. You got this nice leather pull tab right here. And then you got this bronze kind of tip right there. Just, and they've just really done it well with this bag, man. Go ahead, wow box. Now, the other day we did our taxes, man. I hate tax time. Oh. <laughs> if you're a businessman, there's, there's two kinds of people around tax time. There's the kind of person that gets excited and does theirs. As soon as they get a W-2 at the beginning of the year, they go ahead to Jackson Hewitt and get it done, walk out of there, making it rain. And then there's guys like me who end up having to pay taxes because you know I own my own business and stuff. So yeah, it's two kinds of people, man. I usually wait, but not this year. We went ahead and did our taxes, so that's my tax envelope. It's just a manila folder right here that I have in here. But as you can see, let's get in there so you can see that, man. It's got enough space in there for you to put like a couple of notebooks or something like that in there. Plenty of room. But if you look in here a little deeper, it's got a little zippered pocket right there. 
trying to open it up for you. Then it's about half a hand deep. It goes to about right here, okay? So it's about half a hand deep, but it's plenty wide. It's big enough to fit my Galaxy Note 10 Plus in there very comfortably. It's not padded or, or felt lined or anything like that, but it is a nice size pocket for you to put some personal effects or something in there. Then we have a couple of outer pockets, which are big enough to house maybe some business cards. This has the, um, this is my Snap Wireless wireless charger. I just kind of slide it in right there. And then you have two of them actually, one here and one here. And then we have two pen slots, which are big enough to house uh, some markers or highlighters or something like that. So these pens are actually kind of swimming in those uh, pen slots, but we'll put them right here because we need to move to the laptop compartment. Now, once again, it is big enough to house a 15 inch laptop. It's uh, secured by this Velcro strap right here and it is kind of stretchy, but you got some Velcro right there. Got the leather uh, pull tab right there. So let's pull out this laptop because I want to show you more about the bag on the inside. So the laptop compartment is padded. It's padded pretty well and it's padded on the bottom too. There's no padding on the other side. You, well, yeah, there is padding on the other side. So it's, it's padded on three sides, the, both sides and the bottom. And once again, it is large enough for a 15 inch laptop. You could try to squeeze a 17 in there, but I don't think it's happening, man. So you've been warned once you buy this thing. As far as the inside of the bag goes, that's all the organization you're gonna get. But let me flip this flap over. That way you can see the opposite side of the bag. Right here on the opposite side, this is the side that's gonna be next to your body as you're wearing it. You got these magnetic snaps again, boom magnetic snaps and it is a full size compartment which is big enough to house is it can i put my laptop in here hold on hold on let me see let me see just for just for giggles all right yeah you can put another laptop in there if you wanted to man or maybe some file folders some business papers or something like that it will fit i do not suggest you put your laptop in there maybe a notebook or a tablet or something like that it'll fit in there you see how that just did you hear that it just closes on its own so you got your stuff nice and secure in there. And the last thing I wanna talk about is the uh, strap for this bag. Uh, I do appreciate the fact that it has a removable strap with these buckles right here. I really appreciate that. Um, I've never really liked messengers that have the strap just you know fixated on there. I just, I don't know, I like to remove them sometime and just carry it as a satchel. But one thing I wish they did have was kind of a, a leather accented, um, like shoulder pad, but this is a really nice uh, webbed belt kind of strap they have here. It's, I like the color, I like the design. I just wish it had like a leather patch to go as a, a pad right here. That's the only thing I wish it had, but it does carry on those leather accents right here in the leather uh, end point. But then we have these swivel hooks right here, nice spring action, doesn't seem like it's gonna be wearing out and coming loose anytime soon. So it's got a good shoulder strap that comes included with it, just doesn't have a pad, unfortunately. But this bag right here, Mm, mm, mm. Look at it, man. You can hold it as a as like an attache or like a briefcase kind of style, or you can attach it for uh, use as a um, as a messenger bag. Loving the Wow Box bags. Wow Box really outdoes themselves when it comes to quality on their canvas bags, dude. As far as the color representation, this right here, this is a very 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 close representation of the true color of the bag. I know that. Um, you know, sometimes the pictures on Amazon don't do it much justice or kind of alters the color a little bit because they want it to pop. But this is a very accurate representation of all the colors actually because I've set my color on my camera correctly. But this is what you get, man. This is a great bag from Wow Box and I approve of this bag because I am not only a bag whore, I am the president of the bag whore club. <laughs> hey man, enough about this bag. If you had a good time checking out this video and this bag, you go ahead and give me those emoji hands up in the comment section and I'll see y'all at the next one. Oh, so you one of them cats that like to just run up in a place, take what you want and then leave, huh? Man, you better hit that subscribe and notification button that way you know when I'm over here opening up new stuff. And while you're down there, you might want to consider tapping that uh, join button and becoming a member because membership has its perks. See, that wasn't so bad. All right, man, I appreciate you. And I'll see you at the next one. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here?